Hey everybody, Nintendo64 here, welcome back to another video. Now, remember, last video I uploaded was a trailer to an upcoming video as it was happening. Well, here it is. Today I'll be reviewing for you the Motel Hell Pig Mask and also the animated chainsaw prop. They are right next to me, but they're both quite big, so I'll have to do them one by one. Let's start with the chainsaw. Ugh. This thing, yeah, trying to get in the shop. There you go. This is an animated chainsaw prop. It's made of plastic all the way around, but that's it's it's pretty good plastic. The handle, um, that's that wasn't from uh, <laughs> it didn't come like that. That's just from you know be using it quite a lot. So don't, don't worry, it comes fully painted. That's just from me handling it, sweaty hands, kind of yeah. So don't worry. It's not, you know, they, they, they didn't they didn't half-ass it and left it like that. That just will happen over time. Don't worry. They're not sh they're not shady at all. They are a really good company. Uh, so yeah, this I absolutely love this thing. It's one of the best props that I own. It was made. Well, I got this from Mad About Horror. I don't know if they actually made it, but that's on the website. I got it. So turning, it's got on the side on the other side. My, it's got the little thing that you'd pull like to turn a chainsaw on, but obviously that doesn't work. To activate it, I'm trying to get in the shot, you have that, you have a little red button right here. So, turn it on. Yeah, this thing's amazing. So when you turn it on, it makes these blades um spin round like like that, as you can see. I won't do that too much, but yeah, press the button. And then do that. And to conserve battery, it, it does it for so long, then it'll just turn off, which I think is quite clever. Battery compartment underneath. I don't know what batteries it takes, because when I when this arrived, my dad already put the batteries in for me, so I'm gonna assume it's just your standard like AA or something, so yeah. This cost me around 64 quid, well, a little more plus five pounds shipping, so, you know, roughly so roughly around 60 to 70 area. I absolutely love this thing. It's one of the best props I got. I got this during lockdown. Yeah, during lockdown, I've, I saved up some money and I got this, so yeah, I truly love it. Now, moving on to the bigger thing. <sighs> this. <laughs> The Motel Hell Pig Mask. In fact, hold on a minute. I just take the oh, okay. I'm not stripping, don't worry. Here we go. Take this off. Here we go. Motel Hell. It takes a lot of critters to make Farmer Vincent's fritters. No, sorry, it takes all kinds of critters, my bad. <laughs> but yeah, this thing is truly amazing. I love this. This is one of my favourite masks that I have. It is literally a massive pig head. <laughs> this ain't just like, you know, how in Saw, it's like a pig mask. No, 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 no. This is a literal head of a pig. Not real, obviously. It's latex. Got hair... Yeah, it's absolutely amazing. Now, as for the eye holes... Right, try to... Hi! <laughs> the eye holes... You can't really see, it's dark, but yeah, it's inside. You look out the pig's mouth, and obviously, it's a little hard to look out because of the massive-ass nose. <laughs> but yeah, so basically, there's a little history. So if you don't know what Mo... Never heard of Motel Hell. It's a movie about um, this guy called Farmer Vincent... And his sister Ida, they run a motel, and they're known as the like farm business meat is the best meat in the whole of the town. Everyone comes to eat it and all that. However, it turns out they're cannibals. What they do is so the road that goes past the the motel, farm business will leave leave out traps to you know obviously like traps to get hold of the people who are driving by, and then you'll take them to their secret garden. Plant them into the ground so their heads, as you, as you can see, their heads are sticking out the ground. Take out their vocal cords so they can no longer speak, so they're literally making a... 
noise, literally that's what the noise they make. And then when they're ready, he'll then put a noose around their neck, snap their necks, and then pull them out the ground again. And then cook them and then obviously sell them. As for, one, if you're wondering where this pig mask comes in, I don't want to spoil it a lot, but basically near the end... The, the 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 woman the main um like woman character in it is ch- is tied down to like a conveyor belt and the hero who is actually farmer vincent and ida's little brother called bruce who is he is a policeman he works for the police um uh basically he comes in to save her and when and then they hear a noise and farmer vincent comes running in with a chainsaw wearing this pig head yeah, literally, that's what, how, this is how this comes into play. <laughs> it's, it's truly amazing. It's like an iconic scene out of the movie. Now, I'm going to put it on. On the inside, it's really dark, but there's a load of foam, a load of foam pads in it. That, I'm gonna... Probably show you. I just... I'm going to try and see if I can do this. It's not going to work. See, there, a load of foam pad, padding, torches, they help a lot. So, I'm going to put this on. It's a bit of a tight fit, but that's understandable. Hi. I see you. Hi. <laughs> oh god. Very echoey in here. I don't know, I don't know if you can hear me. I have no clue if you guys can hear me not. If you can't, I'm sorry, but yeah. <laughs> this thing is awesome. Oh so, yeah. This cost me well it was it was like sixty nine ninety nine plus five pounds shipping, so around the seventy area again. So yeah, I absolutely love this thing. It is truly amazing. I bought this during. I saved up some more money during lock. You know, during the six week holidays. This so basically it's plus so money that I saved up plus birthday money came up to a total of the, of like the money I needed. I pre ordered it. It came like a week or so, like two weeks ago. I absolutely love it. It is detailed perfectly. Even got little hair. This also yeah, it's got the hair. That is in the movie. The pig head in the movie does have the hair. And you can even... Oh, that. There you go. Now it's got a mohawk. Hell yeah. <laughs> so yeah. I absolutely love this thing. Truly amazing. Um, once again, this came from Mad About Horror. They got it from Trick or Treat Studios. So yeah, basically they got... Yeah, so this came from Trick or Treat Studios. But Mad About Horror was selling it. Which I'm really glad about. Because this is like... it's like, There's only two ways I've found you're getting this fruit. There's only two ways. <laughs> sorry, it's only two ways I've seen of buying this. I'm mad about horror or trick or treat studios. Literally nowhere else I've seen sells this. So yeah, I am really glad that I saved up the money for this. I love it. I love both this and the chainsaw. I love them both. They make a really good addition to my horror collection, horror prop collection slash masks. So yeah, I really hope you enjoy this video, and I will see you all in the next one.